There's also an interesting book edited by Roberto Rossi. If you're really into and you want to understand more of the sciences, the chapters are bite-sized. Okay? The chapters of this are bite-sized. Understanding of creation answers the questions on faith and science. The hard part when you teach science, math, and others in an academic school, you don't simply read your subject matter. You read and enrich yourself by resources that will help you understand a faith-based concept or the concept of intelligent design. One of the books that took me years to finish, I got it when I uh, was still uh, trying to sort out origins because of Dr. Pilata. So I started to start buying books on origins. So what I'm sharing are not uh, mostly animals publication. So I asked a teacher who was uh, going to the States and said, uh, because the scarcity of books there. I asked the teacher, please, can you please buy this one? And upon coming back, we bought it. And uh, Ariel Roth bought it. First chapters were good, the second, the fourth chapter, the fifth chapter was a scribe. But I was able to finish it. A good read, especially if you're teaching natural sciences and science. Read, honestly. But those who are in math, there's another book written by Ariel Roth. He started using concepts on science, math, and physics. Science discovers uh, seven, yeah, okay, seven compelling evidences or convincing evidence. Evidence. The next book that I'd like to share with you is this one. Faith, Reason, and Persistence. I don't have the hard copy on the third edition, I have the first and the second. This is uh, published by Danvers, originally authored by Leonard Brown. The fourth edition, uh, sorry, the third edition is co authored with Arthur. The next, I don't have a copy of it. The next is the last on the list. I don't have a copy of this yet, but I think you know one of the contributors of this. He comes from your college. This is edited by Gibson, Rowling, and Grassi. And one of the contributors in that book comes from the College of Science and Ecology of the UK by the name of Dr. Borges. How I wish I could uh, get this book. Maybe it's something. Friends, all of these books are simply to whet your appetite, your quest for more learning and knowledge. There's a lot. But let's talk about friends, theology, and that's what the title is. But please excuse me. After reading and uh, doing some juggling with my presentation, I started to add the last part, which is threads, theology, and the teacher. Simple mnemonics, so you remember concepts that are being shared. Threads, theology, and teacher. Reading from this book, Suddenly Added This Higher Education in North America, which is also a good read for all of us. Sorry, I think by now, it's obvious that I like to read. And Sir Katalai, who have helped and load the truck when we pull, I think, around a third of our boxes, if not half, our books. He said, okay, reading from one chapter of this, Thomas David said, understanding Christian education in the 70 and its higher education, which is published in this section. Christian education today is a massive, 
complex and very expensive under Just on the salary. Now talk about 